These are Allegro Industries 9535 series airbag blowers. In this video, we are going to cover how to correctly handle and operate these units, which will act as an example of how to work with any of our airbag blowers. This series includes an 8 inch and 12 inch model with either 15 or 25 foot ducting. The ducting is a single ply, lightweight, vinyl polyester material. It has a PVC coated 180 degree Fahrenheit, temperature resistant, non-collapsible, retractable design. It also includes an integrated nylon attachment strap on each end. The blower system is built into a specifically designed double wall duffel bag for an all-in-one ease of operation. This unit is offered in either DC or the CSA certified AC configuration. Our AC models operate off standard electrical wall sockets, while our DC models operate off the standard truck battery, which is optimal for when you're in locations where electricity isn't readily available. All of our airbag blower systems produce minimal noise while creating sufficient CFM for your confined space needs. Our two-speed 8-inch AC blower produces 760 CFM at its highest speed, while the single-speed DC model generates roughly 670 CFM. The 12-inch models produce 1840 and 1360 CFM, respectively. These models' lightweight design makes them extremely portable, the 8-inch weighing roughly 25 pounds and the 12-inch model weighing 35 pounds. To operate your airbag, simply unzip the ends of the duffel bag and clip the end flaps back so they don't hinder airflow. Next, pull out the ducting from inside the bag and drop it into place. Be sure that the airbag is a minimum of 5 feet away from any confined space so the exhausted contaminants don't get drawn back into the intake side of the blower. The side zipper contains the AC or DC power cord. The AC models feature a zipper on top of the unit where you will find a convenient carry handle and the two-speed on-off switch. Once the AC model is plugged in, turn it on. The switch has a high and low flow setting. The DC model turns on automatically once connected to a truck battery, so be sure to have everything in its proper place before connecting. Once the confined space has been purged of any hazardous fumes and contaminants, the area is ready to enter. Before entering into the confined space, refer to the OSHA confined space standard to be sure all other safety equipment requirements are in place. After you're finished, simply turn off and unplug the AC unit or unhook the DC unit. Slide the power cord back into the zippered pouch, leaving the AC plug or DC clamps exposed. Then pull the ducting back into the bag. Close and zip both ends and you're ready to go. Quick, easy, and convenient. For information on these and other products, go to www.allegrosafety.com.